Hi, I'm Alexis. I'm the horticulture agent in Boyle County Extension, and we're here at South Farm uh, to talk about pinching flowers uh, in high tone today. So when we do uh, flowers, you're essentially pinching out the apical bud, which is that top bud. A lot of times you're pinching out uh, your flowers that maybe already have. The goal here is that we increase branching. Uh, the other thing that we do is we make our stems smaller. So by increasing branching, we're going to get three to four times the amount of flowers we normally would get, but we're also going to get used usable stems uh, and so that's really important we don't want broomstick handles uh, for our arrangement so we're going to be pinching amaranth uh, some straw flower cosmos and zinnias today okay so when we get down into amaranth so this is coral fountain uh, and what we're going to do is essentially just pinch out this top little bud. So you can use snips. Um, I like to use snips because they're a little bit smaller or if you've got nice tender growth, you can actually just use your fingers. So as you can see, this guy's already starting. Uh, and what we want to do is just pinch up his head. You really can't go wrong. If you go too deep, you're probably still going to be fine and you're going to actually increase branching. So what you can see here, hopefully, is you've got some branching starting. And so by pinching off this top bud, we're going to encourage these branches to go ahead and start forming and they will be nice usable stems for us. So this will delay your blooming by about two weeks, depending on what you're growing, uh, but it'll be much better in the long run for you. So if we want to move down to straw flower, so these guys are just on the cusp of being able to pinch. Some of them are still kind of small, so you can wait a little longer and pinch all at once. Uh, but we're going to show you how to pinch the guys that are ready. And so uh, here you can see down in there, you've got your, this is your apical bud. And we're going to get as close as we can to him and pinch that out. So it's gonna look like a uh, army worm came through here and ate all the tops off or a rabbit. Uh, and that's the goal <laughs> is to look like something came in here before. So this is what we have left. And then with Cosmos, they're a little bit easier because we can actually do some counting here. So we're gonna, we want to leave two true sets of leaves. So down here, you can see what were probably the cotyledons uh, or they're just kind of some rough looking leaves. So we're gonna count one, two up and we're gonna snip right above there. And so again, you can see where this branching is starting to come out. And that's what we want. We want to get more branching. And so they're going to look really rough for about a week, uh, but I promise they'll recoup. So down here, so we've got uh, our cotyledons or just kind of those first little baby leaves. And then we go one, two, and we snip. It's really important to get as close as you can to that uh, node, just so that that cut will heal itself properly. So next we're going to do zinnias. You can still, you can see here that uh, this guy has already started blooming. And so ideally you want to do pinching before bloom, but it's totally fine uh, if you miss that window where you've got some that start earlier than others. We can see here that this one has already started branching. So we've got one, two, three branches coming out of that node. And that's what we want to encourage. Uh, so again, we're going to go, uh, we're going to pinch at two. And so if you look down here, you can see where this would have been those cotyledons, those first little baby leaves that come out. And so this is the first true set, second true set, and we're gonna snip. We're gonna snip better. <laughs> so it's gonna look really bad and I understand that, uh, but that's what you're looking for. And these ones are easy because you can count uh, and you really can't go too low with these ones and you'll get good at it and get fast. So that's how to pinch flowers in the high tunnel.